something a little bit different for you today in our galley segment. In the past, we showed you everything from Japanese dishes to Cajun dishes. Well, today we're going to show you Chinese technique for cooking fish. And standing next to me is the owner of Paul's Kitchen in Monterey Park, Donald Yi. And Donald, what are we going to be doing here today? Okay, first of all, I'd like to introduce uh, our head chef, it's Ken Chin right here. Hello, Ken Chin. Okay, Hi. and uh, he'll come up here to start to uh, prepare the fish. Okay. To cook. And the first dish we're going to do, I know you, you mentioned it's going to be a steamed dish. Steamed fish, right. Okay. So he starts off by cutting? Cutting all the fins. Okay. Cutting the dorsal uh, fins. Okay. okay. What he's cutting here oh. is making it easier, the heat's going to penetrate. So as far as the whole, the whole fish, it's going to be evenly cooked. And I noticed on this fish how clear the eyes were and stuff. That, that means this is a very fresh, very fresh fish. fish. Exactly. Okay. So a lot of time when people don't know, when, when they go to buy a fish, the first thing that you should look at the eyeball. If the eyeball is cloudy and so on, and you look at the fish itself, there's no slime in there, then that, that fish is, it is not fresh. Okay. okay, so now we got our fresh fish ready. Yes. The fish has been cut up. It's already been cleaning everything. Yes. Now what are we, what's the next step? Okay, next step, we're going to put them in a, in a, a, a steamer. Okay. So our chef's going to put in the steamer for us. Boy, this is a large steamer. Yes. What I'm doing right now, you put in some light soy sauce. And then some dark soy, a little bit of dark soy sauce. Oil and some white pepper. Slightly a little bit of Ajinomoto. So mix them up. And this will be added onto the yes, fish after. This is day. after the, the fish is done. This soy sauce will pour over the fish. Okay, no, no other. After that, then you got green onion. Ginger, uh, cilantro, put it on the top. Okay, so the fish is done steaming. Yes, that's been done. Now what are we doing, Tom? Tom. So this, the, the last, putting, putting all these ingredients in there, like I mentioned, got ginger, got green onion, got the Chinese parsley, then you pour the sauce over, that's the seasoning. Okay. All right, the last step, I put some hot peanut oil. The reason is this, the, the, the oil brings out all the ingredients, the ginger, the, uh, the onion, whatever, the flavor, mm -hmm. it's gonna come out. Okay, so this is our steamed dish. Yes. We start out with basically a rockfish. Yes. Rock, fresh rockfish, and then, like you said, you cut it, and then we put the ingredients on top of it. And we let it cook for what, 15 minutes? 15 minutes. I'm gonna try a little piece of that. Dan, you gotta dip in the sauce. Dip, oh, in, dip the sauce. in the sauce. That's okay. where. Mmm, that's delicious. It's not, you know, no other uh, artificial thing. It's natural. Yeah, that's wonderful. Good. Thank you very much for having this. You're welcome, Dan. Good. Thank you very much. And for those of you that have never tried a Chinese dish like this, I highly recommend you come down to Monterey Park. Remember, it's Paul's Kitchen on Atlantic Boulevard. This is good.